So let's talk about that. Did you see the clip of King Von? Definitely. Basically, for the Violation. People, people who don't know what I'm talking about, King Von was about to be put in a dorm within the jail, and uh, it was apparently an op dorm. There's a bunch of people totally he had problems with in there. So he tells the cops that he needs to go to PC or or, or be put in a separate dorm because no. he was gay. No. He said he'll need to go to PC. My boy Beast and Dangerous Minds on the 100 side of the clubhouse ran a room. Go to them replays. He did the whole shit. Like, they went over it. And... You know, I had some back and forth with somebody did to me, my man Kiddo, mm. right? And um, Kiddo called me, and he was trying to break down the politics of Cook County Jail or whatever. And he was saying people do that to try to get to another right. area, right? I don't think anyone actually thinks that Vaughn was gay. And I'm telling, I don't know nothing about that. Right. What I'm keying in is I need to go PC. And I'm telling Kiddo, Kiddo, listen, I hear you, Neff, because I respect you. Right, but you young niggas can't rewrite these rules. Mm. This shit was scripted with me before me, right? There's a way you get off a floor or get to a floor, and it's never acceptable to tell an officer you want to go PC. Mm -hmm. You got to get off, and you got to keep getting off until you get to where, whether you get off on the inmate, whether you get off on the police, it's probably going to be some whole time. You might catch some time. But if it's that serious for you to get somewhere, you do what you got to do. So you're saying that if Vaughn knew that there were five guys in there who all had pokers ready to stab his ass. As soon that, as he walked in he the door. he might dorm, literally be dead in five minutes if he walked in listen, there. He still has to go in to uphold nigga, the street code. you talking to a real power room. I'm just trying to figure listen, out the rules. Where it was not common, Right. But we wasn't in style. You know how many motherfucking times I had to, my comrades before me had to, niggas got on county bus, nigga out of 50 inmates, right? It's one or two bloods and we apart from each other. Or you walking through 9,500 and they just did a crip sweep and you the only one in there, right? It's never an option to go tell the police. You know how many times I've been at the gate where they finna take the cuffs off and put me in this holding tank and everything in, me, in there is an enemy? You got to walk in, first step, get off. That's it. Ain't no, I can't go in here, it's PC. These youngsters think they can rewrite the script of what it is, right? And that's not an option. Kiddo fought me on it. And I respect Kiddo, so I chose not to continue to have a conversation. But Vaughn's a young guy from Chicago. He doesn't know about all the rules that have Fuck been passed you a mother down over the years, lie. right? What? There's a universal rule. Every city, state, and county in the United States of America PC means PC. You do not go PC. Okay, remove the PC thing. Say, There's no removing but it. But say Vaughn had just said, I'm gay, I can't be in that dorm. I'm Try, not trying playing to get like into that a different either. dorm. That that's not cool either. No, I'm not playing. What if he I'm knew not, he would be dead in five minutes if he went in there? Listen, man, listen, he knew the job was dangerous when he took it. Mm. Don't be doing nothing on the street. You ain't ready to face where you gotta go behind them bars. Nigga squabble up, knife up, do what you got to do. Did what he was supposed to do as soon as he took a step in that dorm before the cop got a, a step away, get off. They going to come get you. Obviously, you can't go in there. They going to put you in another dorm. Keep getting off until you get somewhere that you comfortable at. What if he dies in the process? Yeah, nigga, that's what come with it. It sounds like you want the younger generation to crash out because the rules oh, no. are so insane no, no, that they would have caused you to crash out. You're somebody who's been out of the prison system for all these years, and now you want to inflict these cruel, arcane fucking philosophies on the younger generation, even though they're not even from the same state as you. Adam, when I hit that county jail, when I hit them penitentiaries, shout out to little man Six Deuce Brim, the rules was the rules. Right. You live in this motherfucking life, this would come with it. You're restricted. The things you could do that are normal and cool, I can't do. Mm -hmm. You could go in there and say, there's too many black people in there or whatever. I want to go to protective custody keep away. And nobody will have nothing to say about it. You won't get no backlash. I'd say there's not enough black people in there. I need a new option. So <laughs> if I did that, I'm going to roll up. Okay. Shout out to Foley from Foley's. He's running that county jail right now for his people. This is real shit, right? This real shit. Vaughn, if you're that and you say you was that, you can't say that. Mm. You just can't do it. It's like a Muslim hungry 
And it's a pepperoni pizza right there. He can't eat that under any circumstances. See, I don't agree with that either. They don't eat pork, brother. If you're going to die, wouldn't, you know, whoever the fuck the Muslims answer to him, I'm going to name them because I know they don't like uh, non-Muslims Allah. talking about him. Allah. Allah. Wouldn't Allah understand that you ate the piece of pizza because you were going to die? Listen, brother, then maybe it's your time to go how you go, but they are going to accept that before doing that. Right, it's I'm, not. With, it's not an option. You just seem like you're. you're well, it is an option. You're. You're being so about strict get- about these rules as someone who just initiated a, a collaboration between a gangster and a snitch. What you mean? Say in it again. My, in Miami. What about it? But why are you being it. so strict about these rules about how prisoners behave when you're somebody who a lot We're of people would say prison. that you fudged the rules I'm of the game by making a snitch to a song with a gangster? The day I bring. A snitch to my projects around my homeboys. Any of that, I'm in violation. Straight up violation. But don't a lot of the gang members in LA think that you are in violation because of the fact that you're even working with 6ix9ine in the listen, first place? Listen, a gang member in LA cannot tell me how to provide. I'm going to tell you why. If you broker than me, I don't want to hear nothing you talking about. Oh, that's such a cop out. This is real. Adam. Adam. This is real. <laughs> I do nothing illegal to generate revenue. Right. I don't even have conversations about money with uh gang members unless they come tell me my grandmother's losing their house, bro. I know you know about it. Can you help us save it? Mm-hmm. Right? Other than that. I'm not going to tell you about what goes on in the parks in your garages. I'm not going to come in there saying why you got this snitch in the park mm-hmm. or why you hang it with this motherfucker who rolled it up. That's your world. Okay, so I don't get no money. Listen, and you're not going to tell me what I can and can't do in that building. If King Vaughn was from your hood, just hypothetically, they'd have beat the fuck out of him. That that. video came out. They'd have beat the fuck out of him, maxed him out. But it's not a put off. He's still from the hood. They gonna beat. I mean, it probably will be. Really? But you know, they gonna max him out. However, not if he's a famous rapper. They don't give a fuck about that. Mm. They don't give a fuck about that. And unless he he might start to pay his way, the homies the homies in the streets. I got homies in the streets. (laughs) They run in the neighborhood. That's my little homies. I don't run the neighborhood. I have not because seen, I'm not in the neighborhood. I haven't seen a single BD have anything negative to say about Vaughn. Even and I mean, why? Because that's the fucking hero of their area. And even if he wasn't dead, I feel like it would still be the same shit. I wouldn't give a fuck what they say or don't say. What we saw and what we heard should teach these youngsters what not to do. See, nobody ever anticipated a body cam from a county jail mm-hmm. hitting fucking Instagram. Vaughn definitely had no idea that this would ever hit the internet. Fuck no. The same way he didn't know all those tweets would be used to corroborate a Traveler Ross serial killer documentary. Right? So at the end of the day, I got to call a spade a spade. Me, him, them. If I use the word, I want to go to PC, mm. that is a violation. And you will be dealt with. It's ways of... Getting off a yard or getting off a floor, and it's telling the officer you want to go to PC. It's never one of them. Okay, lesson learned. All right, so you see it. We just hit 500k. And you know what that means? That means you gotta subscribe and get us to 600k because we are dangerously close to 666k. Let's go.